guys, welcome to day five of Isolation Diaries. It's Friday, I made it to the end of the week um, and I am flagging today. It's hitting me now how boring it can be. <laughs> um, I just want to go outside, I just want to go out. It's all good, we're getting closer to the end. Um, I feel back to normal, but I have no symptoms. Luca is fine, so it's just counting down the days now. But yeah, I've got washing everywhere. <laughs> I've just put my duvet up over the door for now, um, and I've just put a wash load in, so sorry if you can hear that. It's a bit bittersweet because today is the day I should have been going to Bolton, so seeing um, the event organiser like tagging people and oh, it was a bit of like oh, gutted, <laughs> um, but it's fine. It's one of those things and I'll do it again next year maybe. Maybe I won't. Maybe I won't do it next year. Maybe I'll try other things next year. <clears throat> so the plan of action today is not much really. I'm um, I'm gonna tidy up, do some washing and get organised because next week Matt will be back home and it'd be nice if the house was absolutely spotless when he was back. Not for him to return to because I'm not all about that. More that if it's so spotless when he gets back, <laughs> any mess that's made is him and he can sort out. <laughs> um, so I think that's kind of what I want to get done. Um, but yeah, my morning didn't start off too great because, well, no, last night. So last night, I'm sat watching TV, everything's fine. Next minute, a massive spider just starts walking along the floor of the living room. And when I talk about a spider, I'm not going to show you because someone will be like, nah, it wasn't that big. It was huge. It was the biggest spider I've ever seen in my house. It was massive. It got all three of our attention, me, Luca and the dog. All of us just looked. That's how big it was across the floor. I let out a shriek. Luca screamed. The dog panicked. <laughs> so... I, I leapt up and I grabbed Luca and I ran to the door and my thought was that Max, the dog, might jump down and maybe, I know it's awful to say, eat the spider or do something or scare it away. No, Max jumped and ran off. He was that scared. He ran upstairs. So I literally turned the lights off, turned everything off, shut the door, ran upstairs, <laughs> me and Luca got into bed. And I was like, I can't go back into that room. I don't know if anyone else is scared of spiders. I'm just absolutely terrified um and it was in that moment I was just like I am really alone like in that moment I would have asked Matt, Matt I mean he's a scaredy cat as well he wouldn't have done much but just having someone with me in that moment when I've got a screaming child a dog that's barking I'm panicking um so this morning well I couldn't get to sleep for one thing like I barricaded every door <laughs> like that was gonna stop the spider coming Anyway, I managed to get some sleep, woke up in the morning and just thought, I can't go downstairs. Like, I cannot. I'll open that door and there'll be a hundred of them. I was just convinced of it. Anyway, managed to get up. But I managed to go downstairs and I can't find the spider. And that's even worse, isn't it? It's even worse when you can't find it. So, um, I don't know what I'm going to do. Luca's happily in there, but I, I'm just sat in the kitchen. I just can't go in there, even though it's probably not even in the front room anymore. But we pulled all these toys out. It's not in his toys. I'm just sure later it'll make another appearance. And I'm absolutely dreading it. So I'm really sorry. So I'm really sorry if there's people out there that love spiders. Um, I hate them. <laughs> and I hope it doesn't stay but my mum made a great point and she said that spiders are good because they get rid of your flies and I was like yeah I agree I, I do hate hate flies and that's good but I don't have any flies <laughs> so why is the spider here um so yeah anyway then this morning uh Luca decided to overfill his nappy all over my mattress because I'm washing the bedding it's just um you know when you just you think to yourself, gosh, I was supposed to look so, like, done up today at this event, like, and I was meant to just be living my best life, and instead I'm at home fighting spiders and defecated, defecation stuff all over my mattress. Anyway. 
Um, Work-wise, uh, I'm working more on the planner. I've put uh, a market research poll up on my Patreon and it's public. So I would really love your feedback. Um, you don't need to be a patron to take part of it. It's just really easy to take polls over there. So I'll leave a link below. If you can just click on that, I'm basically asking for you to like do a checkbox of all the different social media that you use and mainly the ones that you plan content for. Um, and it will really help me out. So please check that out. Please just, you know, fill that in for me. Um, but it's going really well. The the planner, I spent a lot of time on it yesterday. I got loads done. Um, and I'm pretty much there with the layout of what I want. So it's just a case of just making it nice now. Um, and then I'll start getting some testing done of it before I finalise it. But that's it really. I'm probably not going to film over the weekend just because I, I, I wouldn't normally. Um, so I'll be back with another diary update on Monday. Um, I think that's when Luca is free from isolation. I don't know. I'm going to work it out this weekend. But at some point in the early next week, as long as I really have no symptoms and I'm testing negative, I could need to do another test today, um, I'll be heading back to the office soon. I can't wait. I'm so excited to get back to the office. So yeah, there we go. It was a little bit of a shorter update from me today. I hope you're all doing okay. I hope if, I know some people have said that they've tested positive and they're isolating. I hope you're doing okay. I know how rubbish it is. Um, I hope you've got support around you. Um, and yeah, I'll be back on Monday with another little update. Hopefully nothing shocking has happened. Hopefully the spider didn't come back. Um, and yeah, <laughs> I'll see you on Monday. Bye guys.